Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I want to show you the progress. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do today. Every day I'm trying to do a little bit extra to the Mustang. I've been working my tail off trying to get this thing going. Going through a fuse line problem and I figured it out. Well, I took in the battery out because I guess I figured out the drain. I want to tell you something about the car. The guy took the car to somebody to get it worked on and the, the owner, the guy I bought the car from, took it to another shop. And um, a guy at the shop, right after he dropped the car, called the owner back and said, dude, I'll trade you right now for a truck I got here that's turnkey that has no issues. Well, <sighs> this problem down here was Fuse 9. I was looking at it and thinking about it a lot last night. And... I've pulled it and retaped it, but somebody used, somebody basically cut this wire here, and instead of routing it like this, they purposely routed it down there and pushed it against the radiator, and before they clipped it, they went ahead and twisted the connector so it, it opened up the cut, and they use wire strippers and pulled it back in one place here in the middle and one place further down now instead of this being I've placed it at this location and pulled the other piece up as you can see well I've taken care of that problem and I wrapped that one wire individually before I wrapped all of these I wrapped both sides of this connector and I'm going around hitting all the spots whether it has problems or not and just making sure nothing's touched especially after a problem like this and this much work I've put into everything's pretty much been deloomed in the car and gone through the one place I haven't gone through was just my next place was this fender well here but now I'm not gonna go in there and I'm not gonna mess with that so that parts taken care of and I'm 100% sure Fuse 9 is taken care of with that. Now let me tell you why. I've pretty much torn the whole car apart. This is back together for the third time, the dash. There's that piece there. Um, well, I've decided now the tan's cool and all, but I've had a lot of tan cars. And this is called peanut butter to me. You know what I mean? Well, I'm tired of peanut butter. I think I'm ready for a triple black Mustang, meaning black outside, black top, and black on the inside. Yeah. I'm thinking I'm really liking digging the word triple black convertible. So, with that being said, I have a 1995 GTS, and a dash, steering wheel, and everything is in mint condition. So today I'm going to seal this wiring mess, I'm going to pull the dash off another time. And all the wiring now, I'm going to re-loom instead of de-loom. Down here, all the way to the back, in the back trunk. Now I need to get everything back together, taped up, so nothing will be frayed once I reinstall it. I don't know if I'm going to use the that whole factory dash from the 95 and then put the alarm in. But I'm going to see. I'm not there yet. But all the connections here are good. I have one black connection that says to the horn. But uh, it's disconnected. i got to figure out where that goes. Other than that, um, I'm pretty sure the car would start now. But I'm not going to mess with the starting and running. Because I want to get this dash out. Get the black dash in and get everything loomed up and back the way it was. Sort of, kind of. I might drive it loom it up and drive it with this dash for now until I go pull the black dash and throw, just throw the seats in because now the seats have to come back out I have to weld up that little spot in the passenger side and I'm gonna get frame connectors under here uh, fit frame connectors Stiflers make some 94 to 04 they're awesome and they're perfect because this is a convertible you get it? So I'm going to do the frame connectors before I put the carpet, and that has to be welded in. And I don't want to mess up my new carpet, you know what I'm saying? And that has to be welded up over there. So these are the steps I'm going through, and I'm going to do it a little at a time. I'm going to slow myself up, but I plan to get the car running by Friday. 
you know, uh, get this dash back in there, get it relubed, and have it run, and that'll give me plenty of time. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and walk around. Now I'm going to be doing suspension next. And um, I have to clean the cards dirty. I've been out of state for a little while. And I'm doing, I put this 200 amp all, 